beautiful day of uh, how not to suck at teaching. Today, uh, some of you, if you've been watching my videos, know that I'm not going the usual way uh, to school today, and that is because there's a horrible accident, and um, I don't like cars. <laughs> Oddly enough, I've got no cars where I'm going, so uh, I'm doing actually quite well for this. Um, so, what do you need to know today in, in, uh, the, in on the lesson? Big turn. Okay. Um, today's lesson is you don't always have to guide yourself. And I'm doing this because I'm going this other way and I'm having to follow my GPS. Um, and I got the volume turned down so that it's not interrupting the video. Please turn right and 500 feet ahead. Um, so today, so today, I'm, I'm following the, I'm following this guide, and he's telling me how to get there. Um, and you don't always have to plan for yourself. You don't always have to come up with um, your own way of doing things, following your own process, following your own. Um, methodology and doing everything by yourself. You can have somebody else do that for you. I'm, uh, and that's why I make some of these videos. Is if you watch my art videos and how to make a process, how to do something. If you like those, you want to use those in class. Fine. I I encourage you to because I like. I think that the way that I'm doing it's great. Some of you might think the same way, and I do want to encourage you into. Don't hit the cars. Um, I do want to encourage you into using that because. You know that sometimes that's an easier way to do things. Um, and case in point, you know we use a GPS, we use Waze, we use Google Maps, we use um, all these ways to get from one, a, point A to point B instead of actually taking two minutes and looking up on Google or um, looking at a map and figuring that way out ourselves. We have somebody else do that for us. Um, and the way that YouTube works, we got a lot of people on YouTube who are teaching you how to do something. Game gamers are like the best and the worst at the same time because you want to be surprised about the game that you're seeing but they're giving you these how-to tutorials on that game and come on come on thank you uh they're doing these how-to tutorials on that game and if they're doing that why why should you uh why should you struggle your brain power to try and get past that one section they they're showing you the process and you know, sometimes a gamer's channel, you want to be surprised by what the game developers have created for you, the gamer, to encourage you to do more inside of that game. But on the other hand, they showed you how to do a way that shows you the, shows you what they wanted you to see, but does it in a way to where you're not sitting there playing that one part for like 30, 40 minutes because it's just difficult. So, not always using something you're not always coming up with everything from scratch yourself is always is definitely one of those helpful tips in teaching and education and uh, for my students in your life uh, using somebody else's intelligence and using somebody else's uh, process to help make your life easier and further whatever you're trying to do a lot better go for it I'm all, I'm all a fan for that uh, because at the end of the day you getting a task done and being successful in a task is just as important as you learning a task some things you don't have to think are some so at the end of the day some things that you do is not as important about the task that you completed that you completed a task um, and, and I look to some of my students in that regard where I know that not every student that I teach, I'm going to have a percentage of students who they aren't great at reading, they're not great at math, they're not great at history, they're not great at science, there's something that they're deficient in. They come in my class, they're successful in my class, and they take that success on with them to the next class, to home, and it betters their life for it. So if they find that that one thing that they did, it was a lot easier because the way that I approached the subject or the way that they went over the subject and it gave them that level of success well shoot to carry that on for the rest of your life it's like the um uh the pat on your back for yourself for that day for doing something well all for that as always if you like the video give it a thumbs up uh, a subscribe is always appreciated if you don't like the video well you know what to do other than that as always guys i will see you next class later